Good morning, Crusty Crew. We are From here. Castaway Key. Castaway Key. Finally, our favorite place to be. <sighs> Love it. Uh, it is a little after nine, I think. Yeah, nine oh six. Nine oh six. All ashore was eight thirty. Mm -hmm. Slept in a little bit um, because there is mm -hmm. like seven adult groups on this ship, and I don't think we're gonna have a problem finding a seat on yeah. Serenity Bay. Yeah. <laughs> so uh, we've just had a nice leisurely morning. Mm -hmm. uh, Kelly had an amazing breakfast. <gasps> what did you have, Kelly? Churro Mickey waffles. Yeah. I Mickey have waffles. not had them before, but I see everyone posts about them on Instagram. Oh yeah. And I was so excited to see them and they were so good. So they're the same yes. as Mickey waffles, but they have like cinnamon churro. sugar, like churro, almost like a streusel. Like they weren't overly sweet, but oh, they were so good. Oh, yeah. Awesome. So yeah. we're going to head Castaway Key. It actually did rain a little bit this morning, I think. Yeah. And it's a little cloudy. Mm -hmm. um, the chance of rain did go away, so I think we should be okay. Mm -hmm. The weather's super nice. It's got a breeze. It's like nice. 83 degrees. Yeah. Um, so yeah, oh. we're going to go uh, fall asleep on the beach. Woohoo! And uh, yeah, we'll see you out there. Looking forward to it. We were 100% right. There was, at least when we first got to Serenity Bay, like 10 other people oh there. It was completely empty. Dead. Yeah. So, so nice. Absolutely perfect day yes. at Castaway Key. Really nice weather. It yeah. actually looks like it might be a little little baby storm rolling in. So we came back uh, to the boat mm -hmm. after doing a little bit of looking in the shops. Yeah. Sad they didn't have my cookies too shirt. Um, they had a cookies size. to barbecue shirt and they didn't have Joe's size. Yeah. That's okay. But they did have a lot of new merch, especially for they the Castaway Key nice. 5K, oh, yeah, some new styles new and stuff, Key so yeah. yeah. Super nice. Really um, cool. But I think right now we're going to go up to the pool. It's only about 1 o'clock. Uh, all aboard from Castaway Key is not until 4.45. Yeah. So we're just going to enjoy the ship pretty much yeah. alone and uh, right. uh, get some drinks. And then uh, yeah. we'll see you when we get cleaned up and getting ready for dinner. Yeah. And we're off. Sailing away. Castaway Key. Look at that beautiful water. My gosh. Oh, look at this. Look at that cloud. Oh, it's dumping over there. That's cool. Can I see that? That's oh, neat. Oh, yeah, you see the rain. That's cool. Yeah. Let's the water's that so out. blue. It's so blue. Hello. Hello. We are back from a fantastic afternoon oh, by so the pool nice. after Castaway Key. So nice. So, mm -hmm. so nice. The only weird thing is, FYI, if you come back on the ship around noon, one o'clock, mm -hmm. um, everything's closed. So there was the bars. no bars, which makes sense now that we think yeah. about it, that all the staff work on the island. So they get off the ship and work the bars on the island. Yeah. So they do open again around 2.30. So yeah. just keep that so in mind. Like an we hour were, and a half or so. We, we were back on the ship by like one. Yeah, about yeah. one o'clock, yeah. 
So. Um, and they also had like the the family pool closed. They had a lot of like families trying to get yeah. into the adult pool that was open. My favorite turned away, pastime so. is just watching. I want that job. <laughs> I want that job to kick small children out of the 18 and older pool. Listen, we don't hate kids and families. No, we don't. We just dislike it's just them. very no, it's funny. <laughs> it's very Sorry. funny. You, you know what You're good. I mean. Um, so, the rest of the evening, Kelly is in her Rapunzel best, looking absolutely amazing. I'm going to Rapunzel's Royal Table. I'm very yes. excited. I love that restaurant. I love the show. Um, and it's Pirate Night, and I refuse to recognize it because... Correct. That, I will say, we do hate. Yes, Pirate Night <laughs> is terrible. Night, just not, is not for us. 10 years overdue for not a reverb. The vibe. At the very least, for the love of God, if you yeah. have a pirate menu, just do something else with it. <sighs> that menu's so bad. Uh, yeah. Very glad we don't have the pirate menu tonight. Shh, we have the Amazing Rapunzel's Royal Table menu. Pretzels! So excited. Pretzels! Pretzels! And mustard! Gonna be and great. pickles! Yes. Everything. Everything yes. that is good. So excited. We have all things that are good. So, we're gonna head over and uh, go to Rapunzel's Royal yeah. Table. Before we head off to Rapunzel's, we're hitting the Soul Cat Lounge. They have an amazing menu here. The highlight is definitely the portholes. The experience for two is an insane deal. We'll talk about that more in a second. They have a lot of zero proof uh, stuff as well. And actually on board, a lot of non-alcoholic spirits. Uh, so keep that in mind as well. Um, some barista specials, bottle beers. Uh, another thing also to note is they do have more than just what's on the menu. Uh, keep that in mind. Amazing theming in here. It's all based off the movie Soul. Love that movie. Such a cool atmosphere. Here is the French 75 for two. 20, $30 for two bottles of Moe and a huge thing of like fruit infused gin. Nuts. Here we are in Rapunzel's Royal Table, a beautiful restaurant with a beautiful princess. Uh, really fun menu. A lot of German inspired stuff. Um, we have the Ravioli Chirrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrrr
Drinks okay. to dinner at once. Such a good oh, yes. value. Kelly is obsessed. I'm with obsessed with this. It was honestly. Okay, so Tell at, us. yes. At Signals, like as soon as we got on the ship, we were gonna get some Prosecco to toast going on this cruise, etc. And they had the mini Moe bottles of champagne. One bottle was twenty two fifty, and I was like, absolutely not. Give me the seven dollar bottle of Prosecco. Yes. Or glass sold done. Done. But then we went to Soul Cat Lounge, and this was our first time like enjoying live music and getting a drink. And they had what I really love about the lounge is they have like experiences, so things are table side or done yourselves, etc. So she brought us an infused gin container with like lemon, lime, and lemon, orange. Lime and orange, yeah. And then we each got one of those mini bottles of Moe. Yeah. And the total was twenty nine dollars. After tip and everything else. Yeah. That's a pretty unbelievable that's a deal. deal. So that's including the gin and the champagne. And, and in reality, it got us probably two and a half Oh yeah. French yeah, because you refill, each. you know, we yeah. can't it came with that little like infuser of gin yeah. and then the mini champagne. I'm like, this that's is great. a steal. Yeah. And it was very deal. it was very, very good. Yeah. So I highly recommend Soul Cat Lounge. Oh, so Atmosphere nice. is fantastic. Yeah. The music was absolutely incredible. It was uh, Vox and Keys were playing there. Yes. Um, super, super good. Yeah. Uh, and just really, it's just a really charming, it is. cool it's, little place. What a place. great addition. It is. Honestly. Unbelievable addition. Absolutely loved it. Um, yes, that was wonderful. Rapunzel's yes. Rapunzel Royal was Table great. was wonderful. Um, yeah. The service was a little chaotic. Yeah, so it's our first time back or first time in the main dining room um, on this cruise. Since we did Paolo um, last night. So it felt, so it, it, it didn't necessarily feel like they were behind, but it felt like they, like every server mm -hmm. team had more tables than yeah. they are typically used to. And because everyone was essentially sprinting at all times. Yeah, and we didn't get like the drink menu. Yeah, didn't get the drink. It was it felt very rushed. And then but it still, you know, was an hour and a half or so. Yeah, but then when we, we ordered drinks, because you know the menus and the navigator app, so we knew what we wanted. We yeah. ordered one of the specialty cocktails and it came like I don't know, like an with hour dinner? into it. Yeah, an no. hour like with dinner. So I was like, wow. Yeah, because typically, you know, you know, obviously we, we skipped the first night because we went to Palo mm -hmm. and it was Animator's Palo, which, you know, whatever. Um, you know, and we're kind of used to everybody like introducing themselves yeah. and like talking about everything and going over stuff. So maybe that's and, like, why, slow. too, if we it's weren't like, there maybe the first that's thing. it. Yeah. But yeah, it just it wasn't felt bad a service. Hectic. I was just like, I was like, yeah. gosh. I really want my drink, but I feel bad for them. But I'm not really sure why, like yeah. what's going on. Yeah. So, but it was good. The show Rapunzel was great. Oh, very cute. The, we'll, we'll see if yeah. Lumiere's is a little bit less yeah. crazy That's tomorrow true. night. Okay, for sure. Very sad of Lumiere's. Great um, night. Tonight, yeah, after dinner, we did 90s music trivia, which Joe is very upset about. We so lost bad. by two points. Two points. Yeah, otherwise, we would have won. Um, All because I wrote Michael McDonald for. Walking to Memphis because I stopped. I forgot some stupid idiot covered it Mark in a freaking nineties. Mark Cohen or some crap. Yeah. Where well, that guy is a jerk. <laughs> uh, and know. then I thought, and I remembering now, and I'm not kidding when I say this. Every single time we do nineties music trivia, yeah. I think it's Meatloaf. I oh. will do anything for love, and it never is. So the funny thing is, for years, for years. The 90s music trivia that stumps everybody is who sings the Macarena. Yeah. And so we test each other like throughout the year to see like who will remember. Literally, we've been doing this for years. Like test each other like who sings it, you know. Los Del Rio. Yeah, exactly. You know it. So I was like ready. I'm like, this oh, yeah. is going to be the we one. Were, yeah, we were not going to We were like ready. I'm like, okay, yeah, you were like boom, boom, yeah. boom, boom, boom. And I was like. And you were too. You were bah. getting. I mean, I, I thought it was Shania Twain. It was Cheryl Sh Crow. Which he thinks they sound the same. Please leave a comment down below and say that they are two very different somewhere. artists, somewhere. but thank you. Um, and then I forgot, well, I didn't know who sang uh, Get Ready for This, though. Are you ready for this? Was that in the office or is it Parks and Rec? What is it when, like, the lights go out and, like, everything comes out? Like, are you ready for this? And then they run out. Oh! That was when Dwight is giving his speech uh, at the salesman's conference. Uh, yes. I forgot we'll about that. Stand alone in time. Yes. Blood alone moves the wheels of history. Yes. Um, so yeah, and then after, yeah, we had drinks in there too. Um, and that was probably oh, the nail in the coffin or no gills. 
I had a Heineken, which I haven't had a Heineken yeah, since, so like, Yeah, so we went, you went from champagne to cocktail to beer. As it turns out. Rich well, food. Yep. <laughs> yeah, so that's okay. So, probably why. Um, And then yeah. today, again, pirate night. We don't subscribe to that. Yeah. So, we're just turning in early. Yeah, turning in early. Yeah. Honestly, we got a full day tomorrow. Yeah. We're not going to get off the ship at Nassau like we would never do. Nothing to see yes. at Nassau. So, we're going to relax. Yep. On the boat. And, uh, yeah, enjoy the day. Yeah, I'm excited. Well... If you like this video, make sure to give it a thumbs up. If you want to see more of them, subscribe. We'll see you next time from Young at the Parks. Bye.